So you know what the Michelin Guide is? Yes. They, you know, they give stars and award them to chefs and restaurants, the best in the world. There is a chef who was awarded this honor last year and said, I don't want it because I don't want the pressure that comes along with it. Mm -hmm. And then he was put back in again this year. And he's frustrated because he <laughs> said, like, I really don't want the pressure. And, you know, there's been movies and documentaries made about how some chefs will work their entire careers to even just get one right. star. I think and here he's turned down this honor twice. I get this. I completely get this because there is so much pressure. It changes how your restaurant is perceived. Mm -hmm. And then what happens if you're awarded a star and then lose the star? Have you failed? Right. But you already got a star. You know what I mean? So it just sets up this unrealistic set of expectations that you need to, when he, he needs to just worry about running a restaurant and cooking great food. And that's sort of his, his point of view is, mm -hmm. I want to just concentrate and be creative for the people yeah. who are coming to enjoy my food without the evaluation on top of it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I think of this when um, it comes to athletes too. It's always a little bit easier being the underdog because the expectations just aren't there for sure. you, you know? So if you perform really well, it's, it's great and you exceed people's expectations. But if the expectations are high and then you don't get there, it's, a, it's hard. There's also a little bit of, you know, it's a bit of prestige to be able to say, like, you know, thanks so much, but I don't really want it. Like, you remember the people who yeah. chose not to accept their Oscar, right? right. Yeah. Yes. We're talking about it here in Canada. So, mm -hmm. obviously, this guy's played it well. Very smart. And, yeah, it, you know, it'll change the game probably in terms of how many people are coming to the restaurant. Maybe he can't yeah. deal with that. If he's so good that he's turned down Michelin twice, mm. he must be really good. We should go. All right.